Thanks for joining this quick how-to screencast brought to you by Salesforce Support. To see more content like this, hit subscribe so you get notified when we drop more content. Welcome to the first screencast in the series on change sets. In this video, we're going to learn how to create a deployment connection for a change set. A deployment connection is required between two Salesforce orgs to send change sets from one org to another. You cannot create deployment connections between arbitrary orgs. Instead, you create connections between all orgs affiliated with a production org. The first step is to log into the org where the change set will be deployed into. Typically, this would be a production org. Click the gear icon, click Setup, type Deployment in the Quick Find box, and click on Deployment Settings. Click Deployment Settings. In this screencast, it will come from the full sandbox. Notice that there is a broken red connection for this sandbox under Upload Authorization Direction. Click Edit next to the sandbox where the change set will come from. Click Allow Inbound Change Sets and click Save. Go back to the previous deployment setting page and notice there is a green arrow pointing from Full to Production. Ignore the setting under Deployment Options. If you want to send a deployment the other way, from Production to Sandbox, then the settings must be changed in the Sandbox org. Log into the Sandbox org. Go to Deployment Settings. And click on the Edit button next to the Production org. Click Allow Inbound Changes and click Save. Go back to the previous Deployment Setting page and notice there is a green arrow pointing in both directions. Please keep in mind that in order to follow these steps, you'll need system administrator permissions. Specifically, the Create and Upload Change Sets, Deploy Change Sets, and Modify Metadata through Metadata API Functions permissions. To quickly create a change set, watch the second video in the series, How to Create an Outbound Change Set. There's a link to it in the short description of this video. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or join us on the trail at trailblazer.salesforce.com.